Hey YouTube, thanks for checking out LeboView and today I'm doing a, another review on a different product altogether. I'm trying to add some cameras to my arsenal uh, as far as recording. Um, I did a, another review on a Zoom H1 digital recorder. What that did is allow me to go back to my Kodak, um, which I thought was a Z, ZI8, but I guess it's a PlayTouch, which is technically the ZI10. Um, but anyways, the item that I bought was for my Moto X, and it's the uh, first gen Moto X with an OtterBox case. And I'm going to try to utilize the camera that's on this because it shoots pretty good video. Um, I know that there's some real video files out there that don't like it. It could be better, that kind of a thing. But I, I, I really like the video that this shoots. And again, it'll just add yet another camera in the mix for me, which is uh, really good. So the item is uh, an Ace 3C, is the, the name of it, premium tripod mount adapter for smartphones. And then it says fits the widest phones. It goes from uh, 5 to 10 centimeters wide, and that's pretty wide. Um, it's uh, for the uh, iPhone 6, uh, of course, all the iPhones from the 4 up. Uh, Samsung Galaxy, I'm reading from the, uh, the screen, obviously. Samsung Galaxy S6, S5, S4, S3, the Note 432 LG, G3, G2, HTC One, M8, Motorola Moto X, as I mentioned, the G, the Nexus 6, 5, Sony Xperia Z2, and of course there's more. So uh, here's the item here. It uh, comes in a little Ziploc bag, kind of interesting. Um, so we'll go ahead and open it up and uh, take a look at it. Uh, you just pull it out. Of course, this is a foam sponge right here. Very soft. Um, this is some sort of a rubber. Uh, it's not a soft rubber, but it's still rubberized. I thought when I first got it that um, that you would have to put the phone in and then try to turn this wheel to tighten it down. And that's sort of the final tight adjustment. That That's kind of how you get it to the size it needs to be. You can see there's a place for a quarter inch screw so you can put it on a tripod or whatever mount you have. What you do then, this is spring loaded. You can see here, it opens up and pinches the phone. Now, what I found with the OtterBox and the Moto X is this OtterBox, I mean, you can see this is a curved back. It's considerably curved. If you put it in, which you would think would be uh, uh, face out something to that effect um, or like this we'll go ahead and try to stick it in here and I'll show you what I mean it works and it, it holds it but it is on the edge or the lip of the uh, holder uh, and, but it does a good job what I find I do and I like the better this way is setting it up like that now I know it's much more secure at this point and it's really in there um, because it's sitting much deeper. It's sitting way back into the bracket, um, into the corners here. So there's no doubt that uh, this will hold it more sturdy. But you can put it the other way if you'd like. Now, right now I'm on the buttons. you got to be cautious of that. So you can set it off to the side like that, again, still. And you're going to have it in a mount at this point, um, holding it. But it, it works. It, it does a good job, and uh, it will allow me to use my phone as a camera. That's all I really wanted. So if you want to go with this, if you want to try it out, uh, be rest assured that it works with a Moto X first gen with an OtterBox case. Uh, I'm putting a link down below. Click the link. It'll take you right to it. The item is an Ace 3C premium tripod mount. Uh, it's available from Amazon, and it's a... Uh, prime item so you can just get it within a couple of days thanks for watching i appreciate you watching my videos and keep on watching for more videos like this one thanks bye